All right, this is part three of the Contenders Draft Picks break. We got three packs and five boxes left. Let's get through this now. Here we go. Part three. Peyton Manning at a 99. And then we got Quincy Wilson. Quincy Wilson. Yeah, Samajay Paradine, Todd Gurley, Dalvin Cook, Mitch Trubisky. We got Chad Kelly. We got Quincy Aboyo. Boy, Boyo. I can't say his name. Quincy. Because you're melting? Yeah. Donta Foreman. Sorry? Can you back up and run? Yeah. All right, so We're up. Hopefully. Jeff, can you see me? Marcus Mariota, Billy Sims and Sam Bucky Hodges and Christian McCaffrey. I'm good, okay. D'Angelo Henderson. D'Angelo Henderson. Dalvin Cook. Emmett Smith. Derrick Henry. Chad Killing. Mitch Trubisky. So is Mike. Okay. Corey, what's up? I have a seat up here. Hey guys, we're going to be joined by Corey Davis. Joined by Corey Davis. How you doing, Corey? What's up, How you doing? Good, man. My name is Bill Corey. What's up, Bill? Yeah, not much, man. Hey, we pulled a couple of your cards earlier today. I was just going to show you. This time I got it right. Yeah. I got it right this time, right? I, like <laughs> I swear, if you go on and it drops. I was like, I, I, know you're, I know you're coming over here. So I was like, I got, I got him. <laughs> I didn't want to have you leave like that, you know? Yeah, no, so no, we're going we're gonna to open up some packs here right. and uh, see what we can yeah. pull you again. So Corey, uh, yeah. So Corey, um, how's it being in Tennessee? How's Tennessee? It's good, man. I love Tennessee. Um, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I had some family out there, over in Memphis, but um, you know, my first time being in Nashville, and I love it. Yeah. Uh, we got the legends. Legends. Like that. Like that. What's up? Mariota. My What's guy. That's That's my guy. guy right there. Uh, Did you get a little brown? Uh, Foreman, another Mariota. So these are what? These are gonna be like in stores and stuff. Yeah, yeah. That's we're actually we're actually online breaking for yeah. customers now. A lot of people have you know. Go get one. Go get you one. Go get them. You wanna tell That's everybody good. your like Twitter and Instagram handle so they can. Oh uh, yeah, C underscore Davis underscore eighty one. Check me out. Instagram Corey Davis three. Corey Davis three guys. These are dope. Uh, I like that. Yeah, these they get you in your college uniform because this is right. the first time to pick, take a picture of you. And exactly. Your, so how's it how's it to put that that actual uniform on? I mean, it feels good. Um, let's get out here. And, you excited about that? I mean, I told myself next time I put it on, it's gonna be for business. You feel <laughs> me? But I like it. I like coming out here taking pictures and stuff, having fun. It's a good time. So uh, pull the Noah Brown. <laughs> Noah Brown. Well, Noah Brown. The kid. And then a white <laughs> man out of my I promise you. You're getting real comfortable. 
So did you collect cards growing up? I, I had a couple. Yeah, my dad had some cards. Yeah. Um, I had a couple of them. Which what was you know I know your I know your favorite team right now is the Tennessee Titans. Okay, we all know that right now. Yeah. But growing up, where'd you grow up at? In uh, Chicago. Chicago. Just, uh, just uh, I mean just outside like the suburbs of Wheaton. So you're a Bears fan? Oh yeah, up? of course. Who'd you uh, course. who'd you who'd you like model your game after? Um, I mean growing up, uh, I was watching like Marty Booker, oh, all yeah. those dudes. Um, but I mean like now nah, I like Julio. I like the way he plays. A B. Um, those are two the top dudes in this league today. But yeah. I mean, my favorite player of all time was Walter Payton. Walter Payton. Never got to see him play, but you know, I watch YouTube videos of him and everything. That's awesome. That's awesome. That's awesome. I'm going to open you some know. more packs. Yeah. Yeah. That's that. yeah. Um, what was your favorite college game? What was your favorite college game? Played in? Um, yeah. Probably the uh, Cotton Bowl. Cotton Bowl? Yeah. Oh. What was your what was your uh, stats in the Cotton Bowl? Do you remember them? Uh, I mean, I had like eight for like seventy in a touchdown. But I mean, just the experience is so. We lost that game, but um, you know, just playing there was a lot of fun. Um, you know, first time playing in a um, Jerry World. So yeah, yeah, yeah. It was dope. I liked it. It's pretty funny how everybody calls it Jerry World, right? All right. Yeah. <laughs> so is it true what they say about that big screen on top? It's huge. Oh, it's big, bro. Tell you. I find myself looking at that more than, you know what I'm saying, the actual field. Yeah. What'd you pull there? Uh, Shadobe Awazui. Yee. Shadobe Awazui. Yeah, called Dalvin. Nice. Dalvin Cook, yeah. So each one of these has like a signed. Yep, each pack has a signed one. So we hopefully get you. Gotta get a Corey Davis out of here. That's what I'm saying. No, I might yeah, have you sign these. <laughs> right, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. If you don't get one. OJ. Got. You gotta keep looking, man. Yeah, yeah. keep looking. OJ Howard. Oh, yeah. St. Joe. Where are they? 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 My oh, dog D Rod. Yeah. Oh, there you go. It's my dog. Nice. That's nice show up. Up. It's his house here too. Yup. 99. Darius Rogers, man. Pulling some heat out. Hello, um, my man, D Rod. So, uh, so I asked Dak last year, what does he have any pregame like um, rituals and stuff? And he's, you know, his mom passed away, and he texts his mom before every game. It doesn't matter, right, you know. Right. So you have like pregame rituals like that kind of stuff that you do? I mean, not really. Uh, I bring the Bible with me every time, every game. So I just read that, read the scripture too. Yeah. Um, just listen to music, really, just try to get in my zone. Nothing, you know. Nothing like a superstitious or yeah, anything. Yeah, like yeah, that. yeah. I understand. Rolls. What was uh? I, uh we had a, someone asked a question uh, before. Uh, oh, there you go, yep. Ryan Anderson, Alabama. I forget what I was going to ask. This is Liddy, Liddy, Liddy. Yeah, Migs asked you, is there any particular wide receiver you look up to? That I look up to? Yeah. Uh, I like AB. AB. Yeah, he, I mean. He, Kind of restart a little bit. No, oh, that's um, good. I like Greg Jennings too. He went to Western, so you know, I got a lot of respect for him. And he's reached out to me multiple times. I reached out to him, just trying to pick his brain. And because those those are guys who did it, you know, the right way. Yeah. I got a lot of respect for that. So um, a guy asked, uh, yeah. AB, AB, there you go. Um, when um, when was the first time you played football? You mean like organized or just like backyard? Anytime. Well, how old were you when you played football? When you first played Man. football? First grade, I was probably first grade. First grade? Yeah. What was that like? 
Six, seven, six, seven. No, but I mean, yeah, my my brother always played. He played before me. That's kind of why I got into it. Okay. It was cool, man. I love the sport ever since I've been playing it. And and when did you know you were gonna get you were gonna go to the NFL? When did you know? When was that time that you knew? Yeah, I mean, I always believed <laughs> ever since yeah. I was a little kid, but I, it kind of hit me like, um, and high, like when I got my offer. I oh, okay. Like, okay. I'm kind of talking to Coach Fleck about it. He's like, yeah, you, like, you really have, you know, NFL talent and stuff like that. So um, ever since then, I've just been been grinding, been working towards it. And who was the person that called you when you were drafted? Everybody. Everybody called you? Yeah. Well, who, who, who called you from the team to tell you you were drafted? Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. The GM, John Robinson. Yeah, real, real cool dude, real cool guy. The entire staff is awesome. I mean, they kind of, everything that they, you know, they're about is very fitting for me. Yeah. Isaiah Ford, I'm 15. So what's it like having a football card? And people are going to collect you. I know, that's what I'm saying. You know? Like we, I like it, man. I like it. I mean, we have everybody here watching you and stuff. We have two, we have a YouTube, and we have our Breakers right. channel going on. And these guys are actually going to collect you. You know what right. I mean? That's. I know you've been signing like five to six thousand autographs. Man. Oh my god. I know, but we appreciate it because oh, we're no going to. But I mean, what does that? How does that feel? I mean, what does that mean? It feels good. I mean, like I said, like my dad always had cards when I was growing yeah, up. Yeah. And um, you know, just to see myself on one of these cards is, man, I mean, it's a dream come true. Yeah. So there he is, right there, guys. Check me out. It's on this contenders card right there. Maybe I might give him the sign ball for these. Yeah. If you don't pull something. For real. So is your first is, is your first time out in California? No, I mean it's my first time in LA. First time in LA? What do you think about LA? I like it. LA is huge, man. Yeah, it is. A lot going on right here. There is. That's my guy, Fabe. Um, Fabian. UCLA. Local boy right there. You know, I always ask what people's strengths are. You know, um, football players' strengths. You know, you know, you know all your strengths, right? What are your What are your weaknesses? What do you think you're weak at? Um. It's always the harder one, right? Right, yeah, that's what I think. Uh, <laughs> I'm a Kamara, is he a four? Big card, big hit. Big hit. Man, as a receiver, you can always work on your hands to improve yeah. those. So I work on that like every day. So that's probably the biggest thing. Yeah? Just get my hands right. Contested catch. Titus Bowser. What's your, uh, we had uh, someone ask, what's your favorite ju uh, juke move? Like, do you have a famous, you have a, a patented move that you oh, do? Oh, stiff arm. Stiff arm, okay. I'm about that stiff arm. You're about that stiff arm? Oh, yeah. You take people down with that stiff arm? I've got to. You gotta check me out, mate. Absolutely. Make sure you follow. I'm gonna ask a question. <laughs> that's what's up. <laughs> Other questions. Uh, so Yankee fan asks, who are you most excited to play with in Tennessee right now? Play with? Yeah, play with. Uh, shit, the whole team. The whole team? <laughs> Marcus is a cool dude. Marco, all those dudes are cool. Um, it just feels right, honestly, just playing with them boys. Yeah. I've been, I've been like working out with the vets uh, like a couple weeks now, and they're all cool. Yeah. <laughs> So when you went in, they didn't, they didn't tell you you were starting, right? You got to work at it, right? Oh, I got to. Yeah, you got to work at it. I already it. knew that. Yeah. Uh, so Miggs asks, Corey, how good is Taylor? t -Mo? Yeah, he said, ask where going to be. He's a stud, good. man. That's my dog. <laughs> t -Mo the man. They got a good one, I'm telling you. You see me? Huh? Uh-oh. You see uh -oh. me? Same pack. Is it? Well, yeah, one of them. This is a different one. Though. Blake. What the Jarwin. heck is that? Jarwin. Blake Jarwin. Blake Jarwin. Mm -hmm. 
Kurt. Curtis Samuel. So does 84 mean anything? What it, does it mean something? Or is it just been your number? Yeah, I mean, me and my brother kind of wore um, 84 ever since we were in college. Uh, and it was kind of like a coincidental thing, like they just gave it to us. Yeah. Um, but, I mean, we, we, we kind of adopted, like every, I see 84 everywhere now. Yeah. Uh, and my grandfather, who was, you know, God rest his soul, he's a great man. He was, uh, his birthday was 12, 18. And we kind of like the eight. And if you add up the one, two, one, it's 84 backwards. There you go. So I'm like, I'm just gonna stay with the 84. 84 is everywhere now. Yeah, so you gotta do when you guys do uh they go to kit. There you are. <laughs> they had me. That's what's up. That's awesome. There you go. That's sweet. You haven't read your stuff on the back yet? Mm -hmm. So who has Tennessee? You don't mind signing that one, do you? I can sign it. You say who what? I said, uh, no, I was, I was asking him who had Tennessee on there. Sweet. So, you know. What is your, um, How's this last four days been your experience? This last four with the RPS? It's been busy. <laughs> you guys are busy, aren't you? Yeah, yeah. It's been fun, though. This is my first time in LA, so I'm having a lot of fun with it. Did you go to like Disneyland or anything yet? Did yeah, they let you? Nah, not yet. No. They let you? No. Yeah. I ain't have time yet. Says, what's your uh, favorite Coach Fleck story? Do you have a Coach Fleck story? Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Uh, I mean, he was always good. Like, cause, honestly, you have to always be on your toes with Coach Fleck. He, um, he was always coming in the team meeting room, different things like every week. Um, I mean, one week he came in just as like a pirate. You could dress like a pirate? Yeah. And then other weeks came in, um, for like, short, just short time, like high sock, boxing gloves and everything. And he came in just storming in, fighting everyone. Um, I mean, he, he has a lot of energy all the time. So you got to stand on your toes with him. That's awesome. Uh, it, was, it was fun. I like playing with him. Roll the boat. <laughs> RTB, baby. They already know. Oh, I listen to Future. Future? Listen to Future? Yeah, baby. All that. No country for me. No country. Yeah, there was somebody here, I think, uh, the Thad's country music guy. That's what I'm saying. Got another one. Did you get another one? You think LA was this hot? Oh yeah, I do. LA was hot. <laughs> Ain't a cloud in the sky. That's crazy. <laughs> uh, I got. I'm about to open all these. Yeah. Keep on open. <laughs> I mean, it definitely felt good, especially with all the all the work I put in. And, um, so all the daughters talk about small school, this and all that. Yeah. It was good, but now, I mean, that's over. Now I got to go out there and ball. I got to go out and play and prove why. You know, what I'm saying I'm that number one. Yeah. So, yeah. Like, 
you think there's a lot of pressure on you right now? The, the, the yeah, high expectations? A, a, I mean, I've been feeling pressure ever since I was a sophomore in college. But that's good, though. So, uh, so that means that uh, pressure doesn't relieve you until you retire, right? Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> Always got to perform, good, right? Man, pressure makes you better. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Um, I'd embrace it. Ask, uh, is your coach in the future league at some point, you think? I think so, man. That's my guy. He's a great dude, great quarterback. Very smart. Um, so, I mean, we'll see. I, I hope he makes it. He's doing good. Tim Williams. We know how wide receivers, you know, especially big ones like you, yeah. they go, you're going to be kind of going down blocking sometime, right? Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> who's that Who's that cornerback you want to block? Who's that cornerback uh, you just want to go that against? <laughs> that cornerback. Yeah, I don't go against any of them. <laughs> I mean, I, I, one person I really want to go against in my conference is, you know, Jalen Ramsey. Jalen Ramsey? He's, he's, he's definitely one of the, I feel like one of the greatest in this game. You know, even his first year was, you know, phenomenal. He did real good. If you want to be the best, you got to play the best. I definitely think he's one of the best. So. Yeah. Ryan Anderson. Ryan Anderson. ain't it? <laughs> <laughs> Back, Prescott. Yeah. So did uh, y'all need some Walter Payton ones in here? Oh, I know, I know. Old school. Did you know you were gonna go to Tennessee? No, I mean not really. Not really. I met with them. You know, I liked them a lot. They like me. Yeah. I'm happy it ended up like that. You didn't care, you just get drafted, right? What? I'll take it. <laughs> you're the first person to pull their card, though. You pulled your own card. You said what? It's a, you're the first person to pull your card, though. I oh, know. That's just up. Yeah, he, you've met Marcus, right? Yeah. Yeah. Cool dude. Ha 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 ha. Oh, hella boxes. Yeah. Long day. Long day. So, uh. This is dope, too, because you can see, I mean, like some of these dudes, I'll be forgetting what college they went to. Yeah. Georgia. Right. Oh, man. Um, after this station, they said? Yeah, yeah, after this one. After this one? Yeah, it's like in 20 minutes, I think. Oh, yeah. What, what's your hobbies outside of football? Like, what do you like to do outside of football? I mean, I'm a, I'm a homebody. I like to chill, honestly. I like, I like, I'm a I like big movie more dude. Now. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> I love movies, man. I'm a big movie dude, man. I like to chill. Um, I, golf. I like to golf. I'm fucking butt, but... I'm getting there. I'm getting better. Did you see the, the Guardians of the Galaxies 2 yet? Oh, yeah. What do you think about that movie? That was dope. You seen it? Yeah, I saw it. It was really good. Groot was, Groot was funny in that thing. Yeah, it was. Baby they they kind of milked him a little bit in the yeah, beginning. Yeah, they did. They? <laughs> they did. Have you seen the new, uh, new Aliens movie yet? Is it scary one or whatever? Yeah, that's scary uh, one. Yeah. It's out? Yeah, I think it just came out this weekend. For real? Yeah. I gotta go see that thing. What's your, what's your favorite sport? you have a favorite sports movie? Favorite sports movie? Oh, shit, what do you think? Friday Night Lights, probably? Friday Night Lights? Yeah, here we go. <laughs> what they say? It's 
wide receiver, Jimmy asks, which wide receiver that currently plays or retired that you think you most resemble? The most resemble, damn. Question, ain't it? I asked him, what does he think? What do you think, Jimmy? Someone said Terrell Owens. T.O.? I'll yeah. take T.O. Yeah, someone said Terrell Owens. Oh, yeah. Hey, you ever went up against Khalil Mack? Huh? You ever went up against Khalil Mack? You did? That's a big dude. Hell yeah. My first year on, I ran a, I, I remember I showed, I ran a screen. Yeah, I had 186 For real? My freshman year. Bro, he boomed my ass, bro. I ran a screen, he, ugh. I'm, who is that? <laughs> I got the best, I got the best of him one time when he was high. Man. He was out there ashes. Yeah, I promise you. <laughs> Bro, I remember that. Dry as hell out there. Splat and shit. I'm not sure. Okay, what was your biggest challenge being at a mid major school? What was your biggest challenge at a mid major school? What's your biggest challenge being at a mid major school as a top talent? What was your biggest, biggest issue? Challenge. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I'm like, okay. Man, I don't know. Probably, I mean, we played big schools. Um, and the only thing, like, we didn't really have the size. Like, I love playing against a school, bigger schools, just to, you know, match up against them. But, um, I mean, yeah, we just didn't have the size, so. Yeah. We kind of got whooped up a little bit, but we had beat some Big Ten schools and everything. Is Mac the, the guy who hit you the hardest? Hit me the hardest? Uh, shit, let me think. Um, Lil Mac, he's definitely up there. Buddy from Ohio State. Man, what was his name? Ohio State. Hit, I mean, Iowa had some big ass dudes too. Yeah. Well, it must not have been a lot of gentlemen with a name. Jesus. I mean, I, I got my ass knocked out. I had a concussion. Oh, jeez. Someone never had a. Someone never had. Did Bose ever hit you? No, he never hit. Me. <laughs> Hell, no, he never hit me. <laughs> Stay out of that. Yeah. Bro, you not done, bro. You done? Yeah, we're, we're gonna be done after this. He wasn't even looking at us. Oh, Jimmy's asking, who's faster, you or your brother? <laughs> <Shit>. <laughs> Man, that's a good you, question. <laughs> Leonard Fournette. <laughs> Shit, I'll say, I don't know, probably, I'll dust my brother. I'm going to be honest with you. <laughs> I ain't going to hold you up. I'll dust his ass. Dust him. Nah, he... <laughs> He's fast though, man. He probably got the quickness. I got the size. He got the speed. Yeah, he's pulling heat. Is that what? Pulling, you're pulling heat. You're with the Fournette. Yeah, I know, man.
Rush. Brothers quarterback. Patrick Mahomes. So most of us, you know, in the in the collecting world, we appreciate you doing all that. You know? Oh no doubt. Uh, we always like the fact. So you know how. I'll show you. I'll show you something here. So that's in the collecting business, right? Yeah. I don't know. Everybody's pretty good, and everybody's pretty good. But you know how when you do a when you do a sticker, yeah. you gotta keep your autograph on the sticker because mm -hmm. it because for that's us right, it, right, may, right. it makes it ma it's important for us that your name gets on the sticker. Exactly. So. Uh, so. Mine, years. yeah, mine definitely slipped out a little bit sometimes. Is it? Is yeah. it? <laughs> All right, well, if you want to, can you Ooh. do a shout out to KT Authentics? That's where, that's my company and stuff. Shout out KT Authentics, man. Y'all know what it is. Yep. Follow Corey Davis. Follow him on his Instagram and Twitter. You know, do that hashtag C Davis 84. Check me out now. Yeah. Tighten up. Tighten up. Appreciate it. You, really Mike. appreciate it, man. Thank yeah. you for spending time. Hey, Corey, you don't mind? You don't mind, do you? What? Sign, sign them? Yeah. Oh, okay. This is for our, 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 our people. So it'll be cool. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Guys, he signed some of his cars that he pulled himself. I'll do a recap. Well, Ryan Anderson, Darius Rogers at a 99, Chidobe Awuzi, Noah Brown, D'Angelo Anderson, Quincy Aboyeu, Quincy Wilson, Garden Conley, Curtis Samuel out of 99, Anthony Walker, Crack Dice out of 23, John Ross, Mr. 422 out of 25. 
Solomon Thomas again. She got two Solomon Thomas. Darius Rogers, Chris Carson, Dan Feeney, Carson Conley, Jordan Leggett, Fabian Moru, Bo Buda Baker, Josh Reynolds, Cole Hikutini, Demarcus Walker, Michael Rector, Chris Carson, Desmond King, Chad Henson, Zay Jones, Jamal Adams, Zach Pascal out of 15, Dara Obogawa, Wally, <laughs> Marcus Williams, Corey Davis, he actually pulled his card. Look at that, 19 to 25, Corey Davis. Trey Davis White, Sam Rogers, Gabe Marks, Amba, Etta Tuau, Chris Warmly, Jamal Williams, Evan Ingram, Ryan Ramsky, Cole Hikakutini, Demarcus Walker, Donta Foreman, Desmond King at a 99, Matthew Davis, and then we're gonna throw in a Corey Davis signed by him on the channel. So whoever had the Titans is gonna get this one as well. And then whoever had earlier had the uh, the Broncos. Whoever had the Broncos is gonna get a Carlos Henderson in that one. He actually signed it. So there you go, guys. Thank you, guys. Appreciate it. Really do appreciate everything you guys do for me and support. We're gonna go. Um, I'm not going to start another break yet until because they're saying that we're going to probably have lunch in about 20 minutes. So if I start, we can, we can try. All right, guys. Thank you. I appreciate it.